Let's talk about the tent a little bit. It's too big for me. This is what I've realised. This is the uh, Eurohike Avon 3D LX for the tent nerds out there. And uh, although it didn't cost anything, as it was a gift, although the person who gave it to me doesn't know it's a gift yet. What I have definitely learned is that the bigger the tent and the more the work. I want to be able to click my fingers and the tent to be up. That is my criteria for a tent now. So I, I don't intend to. The last time I put this tent up, I crawled inside it and I sat in there all evening and it was so hot. And I'm not going to go in the tent until it's cool. I have brought a chair to sit on, which is up there. In fact, I'm going to go up there now and cook me some food. Oh, my back. Oh, God. I'm telling you, that, that, I'm, I'm telling you. That was a proper pucker scare I got. It was, I was rolling around in agony inside the tent. But it's not so bad now. Just a whinger. Yeah. Today, today, I'm having steak. Part of the meal deal, it's a peppered uh, ranch steaks with garlic butter from Tesco's uh, with garlic butter. It's been in my eyes all day. Let's do this. Oh man, what are these cars doing? Look at this guy. Where are you going? What are you doing? <laughs> right. Plastic fork. I know. I forgot to bring some tongs. Oh, they hid the fact that it was. <laughs> they hid the fact that it was two beneath the the thing, the label. Oh, hold on. I need to put some butter on that, I think. <laughs> it's splashing everywhere. All right, just stick the thing on there, Craigie boy. Protein, that's my diet these days, just protein. As much protein as I can get. Right then, this is the tasting part, what I've been looking forward to. All I've had today is a uh, protein bar this morning, nothing else to eat. Very nice. It's not tough, it's very succulent. Is this interesting? I really should subscribe to that guy Craig Duncan because he makes videos where he just sits there eating steak. Brilliant! Great content. I've never seen anything like it in my entire life before. He sits there in the middle of nowhere eating steak just like you would in a restaurant. Except he's eating it in some weird place in Scotland. Complaining about stuff. It's brilliant content. I oh, I'm starting. Sorted. Midges like to come out in the evening. I can see them all, they're all looking like, oh look, he's got one of those mesh things on his face. What an idiot. Well you're idiots. Now time to put up the bed but I was so comfortable last time that'll do me I can see the midges there doing their best but they're getting nowhere
No. I know it's not a, a professional way to go. Can you see these midges? I bet you can't. Let me see if I can show them to you. No. Wow, there's lots. Lots and lots. Anyway, bed's coming on. Look, there it goes. Wait, <coughs> wait until there's uh, no creases in it. Are they getting in here? Sure. Make sure this is in proper. There's the bed. Right, in you go. Look at this. That thing there. Oh, by the way, I brought my duvets, my pillows. Huh? Come on now, this is luxury camping. So this thing here, seven pound, it's for gardening. And uh, getting up when you're like me is hard. So this helps you, you can kneel on it, it's got foam. You can use it to do all your tapping in or pegs and then you turn it around and it's a chair. Fantastic. Right, well I think I'm uh, ready to hang out. I'm gonna finish my coffee. It's in my flask. I know you shouldn't have coffee before you go to bed, but that's what I do and uh, hopefully get a good night's sleep. If there's any developments in the night, I'll let you know. Uh, and then we'll see what we're doing tomorrow. Um, but for now I need to stop the filming and spend a good hour just contemplating where I am and what I'm doing and uh, soak it up. Basically, save it. Save it away in my... Uh, file called experiences. Amazing. Right. Hello. It's uh it's like quarter to two in the morning. I've just been outside to uh to uh, well you know and um it's amazing outside because well the whole tent's soaking wet for start i think that's condensation uh although the grass is wet as well uh, the sky's completely clear uh, we would be able to see the stars i can st i can see the stars if it wasn't for an incredibly bright but quite small sun uh, no it's a moon <laughs> it's called the moon uh, just over the mountain peeping out which is lighting up the whole valley everything's silhouetted I can see the rocks in the river um, everything that's light has been picked out the mountains are all these big black dark uh, shapes outlines uh, but more than anything I, I, I'm in incredible pain because my uh, my, le my left side at the back, lower back, is in pain. I'm now thinking it's, it's, I was going to ask, is this my kidneys? Is this my uh, liver? <laughs> so I've been Googling, uh, finding out where my organs are. And I think it's too high, low down to be a kidney problem, so which is good. Uh, so I don't want to go down organ problems. So I think it's probably just a, uh, a, a sprained back muscle or something hopefully I do feel better when I take painkillers I do have painkillers here but I don't have it I've left water up at the car so I'm just gonna ride out the pain until the morning uh, but I think it's gonna cost uh, I was planning to go to Holy Island after this but I think uh, this is best if I just head off home because just uh, taking the tent down and um, Loading the car back up is going to be uh, an ordeal. And then um, I don't really want to put the tent back up tonight, especially if the tent's wet. So that's where I'm at.
morning. How do I look? It's cold and it's wet. It's great. I love it. I'm not in pain so much. Only when I move. Yesterday it was just constant. Had a really good night's sleep. Uh, I, as I say, I woke up at around about half, uh, quarter to two, something like that. And then went back to sleep and didn't get up. Woke up at like quarter to seven. So snug as a bug in a rug. Fully rested. It's cold, but you'd you'd expect that because the sun's not getting through yet. The sun's not up yet. I don't think. Well, I can see the sun's hitting that mountain over there, but the mist is low. So um, time to pack up. Got some more filming to do. All right, we're all done. Look, tent gone. Over in the car. And now we're going to go down that way. But I need it to clear up a little bit more. So we'll see. Bye bye, uh, spot. Kept me safe. Great. Put my foot in that. I ain't got any socks on. I suppose not having any socks on is good. 